And away from that, the quest for portable water rises as it continues to elude the grasp of communities and settlements across the country. Lagos State, a mega city still battles with provision of drinking water. Makoko Iwaya here in Lagos gets its drinking water through its maki water. A correspondent, Funke Adesoji, has more. A 2022 report by the World Bank shows that approximately 70 million Nigerians had no access to basic drinking water services, and 114 million were without basic sanitation in 2021. Makoko Iwaya Floating Community is a waterfront settlement in the center of Lagos and is estimated to be home to around 250,000 people, most of whom lived in difficult conditions. Members of this community rely on commercial private boreholes sunk 15 feet deep into the murky water. We have a uh, silver borehole in the community, but it's private. That means people need to pay before they can get the drinking water. And to get a water here, you have to go by boat. And getting water here is not, is not free. That means you need to pay before you can get the drinking water. The, when the foil is expensive, to get the water, sometimes you go there, they tell you it's 200 naira. Sometimes they, they tell you it's 150 naira. So water we use in drinking, cooking, for bathing. You know, before you can get that kind of water, you have to make a reclaimed land. Then you use pipe 15 feet like 20 of it deep down to the ground. For the government to support Makoko for now, I don't think they are ready to do it. Because there, there is a sand filling going outside right now. And that means they are planning to sand fill the whole Makoko. Rebecca and Mary are both pregnant mothers. They are daily faced with the challenge of assessing clean water to cater for their family. Get water is bad for you. You want fresh water now? One five liter. If you lay Nepal bring light, 15 hours. If you don't get light, 17 hours, 100 hours, and I get the fresh hour. But the place where I go fresh water, is far from here. If I fresh them, to carry them, enter inside, problem. So, you know, you know, easy. But they do while I plant for water. Since morning, we are going to go take medicine and not see water to bath. A day year, they, they don't bring light. Since now, they don't bring light. I'll go beg my friend. The water where they drink, he not give me small. If you won't drink safe, not me say, if my baby pour water, I'll go beat her. I'll go beat her well, well because to carry the water, na everything, 25 liter, to carry her in the morning. So with the drink, I'm small, 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 small. Sometimes, if you won't watch what clothes, we go to the fear, say we don't get money. To watch clothes, we go share them. Watch more tomorrow, and we go watch the remaining one. The government do the water for us. It good, it needs. Say our picking, it go bath in the time, go to school. Sometimes we don't get water, they will go to school on 10, some 9 o'clock because of the water. Mary expressed helplessness seeing her children dipping in the murky water of the community as the unavailability of clean water bites hard in the community. But if you say water, they will too, we're not going to allow them to enter this, this rubbish water now. Lagos State Governor Babajide Sonwulu Adi in 2021 said less than 40% of residents had access to portable water while establishing a new water infrastructure, Adinyo 2. Many wondered if that figure has increased considering the massive migration into the state. However, Goal 6 of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals is on ensuring water and sanitation for all by 2030. This means that seven years from now, every person in Nigeria and other countries in the world should have access to safe drinking water and safe sanitation. But the question is, how achievable is this goal? Funke Adesoji, Silver Bed News 24, Lagos.